Hello, this is David Hale with Tech Dive TV. Today we're taking a tech dive into a new digital wallet, the Isis wallet. Now I'm an AT&T wireless user and they don't support the Google wallet fully. You can't tap to pay and stuff like that. But AT&T does support the Isis wallet and you can get that for either Android or Apple. Uh, but for an iPhone, you'd actually have to get a specific case that works with the iPhone. So it's actually basically an Android app, and all AT&T uh, SIM cards support the ISIS wallet. Uh, basically, you can add your funding sources, your credit cards, your debit cards, to the ISIS wallet and just tap to pay on terminals that have the wired symbol. Now, ISIS didn't support my bank's debit card directly, so it guided me to create an American Express serve account. Now, the serve account will let you link any card to the serve account, and ISIS supports serve. So I did that, and it works great. I can just tap at any place that has that wireless symbol on their uh, credit card machine and pay with my phone. Now, let's take a short look at the short video on how ISIS works. To start using the ISIS mobile wallet, Android users will need an ISIS-ready phone equipped with near-field communication, or NFC, and an enhanced SIM card with a secure element from your carrier. If you have an iPhone, it will require an ISIS-ready case with an NFC antenna that allows your phone to send payment at checkout. To check if your phone is capable, visit paywithisis.com or an ISIS-ready mobile carrier. Once you have a compatible phone with an enhanced SIM or case, you're ready to download the ISIS mobile wallet app. After downloading the app, open it up and get started. Add the required information to create an account, and set a four-digit PIN which you'll need to open your wallet. A welcome screen will appear when your account has been activated. That's it. Now you're ready to add cards to your wallet. So there you have it. That's how easy ISIS is. So instead of taking your credit card with you, just tap with your phone. But make sure that the vendor you're using has that little wireless symbol on their credit card machine. This is David Hale for Tech Dive TV, taking a tech dive. Have a great day.